Hey everyone, welcome back. So I sold, I ransomed off all the prisoners from the last episode. It was like 28,000. And then I sold over 100,000 worth of gear that I got from them. So I just upgraded, I gave some noble bows, better arrows to my companions. But uh, the Northern Empire, uh, they're going, I keep getting confused. Yeah, Northern Empire, the Batanians, I think, just kicked their butt. So they're going to be a lot weaker here now. They've got 378 defenders, though. I've just been going around and recruiting whoever I can find. And the new recruits get 200 experience because of my perks. So actually, I'm not doing too bad. But at 65 infantry, 98 archers. So I don't know. I, I'm curious to see whether they'll attack. This might be my opportunity, though, to actually just... I could besiege them. I've got a ton of money. And they're going to have trouble uh, bringing another army here while the Batanians are fighting them. So I don't know. It'd be awesome to get this. But they're going to have a lot... I don't know if I can uh, actually fight them yet. So maybe I'll wait a bit. The other thing I'm curious about too is I could try see if I can put a a better uh, companion on Omar and see if I can get that uh, loyalty up. We can just check over here. So Varchag, the loyalty is just kind of staying the same. It's kind of it's drifting downwards actually. So I guess I'm not gonna be able to do anything there until I get a much better uh, companion with stewardship. So yeah, let's just go and besiege them. Wait, because I have to make a war against them first. Okay, I just made war and then I found that they're right down there. So I might want to wait a bit. I'll see how the Batanians deal with them and I'll see what direction these guys go in. I could try just taking out a small army here and there, though. I'll just help them out and we'll send troops. Yeah, I didn't lose any troops, that's good. And I want to help the Batanians as much as possible. So every little battle is going to help. Let's get some more loot there, we're done. Let me just see what where the Empire moves their army. So I might just try to besiege them while they're distracted. And then hopefully they will go up there and defeat them. Okay, great. Uh, so for this castle, we'll be looking at... There's at least three. There's one, there's one, two, three, four. You would think there'd be a fifth one or a sixth. Uh, what am I going to do here? I don't want to take the walls out. I'm going to have to really build, uh, work on my skill and kind of build everything. So we're, we'll go for, I think on the walls. Yeah, I'm just going to build uh, two siege towers. And we'll have to build a whole bunch of uh, trebuchets. So it's going to take a while to build all this stuff. But it looks like they're losing, so that's great. But the other thing, too, is that they only have one day left for food. So it's just a matter of, can I take out all of their, their siege equipment? Yeah, I keep getting... I'm b being besieged now. Othlame Castle by the Northern Empire. So they're just down there. But if I can get Zionin, I'm fine with that. So I put Hecaron, my uh, surgeon, I'm going to put him as the engineer. Because he has, he's maxed out with his uh, medicine. There's no reason why I can't have him just work on engineering since it's all on intelligence. So I'll, I'll, I'll easily let Ulthlame Castle go if I can get this. But they're going to starve out. So I'm going to build one. It's just a matter of... Okay, take out some catapults first, then I'll lead a, an assault. 
Just want to reduce how many catapults they have there. They got that built. They have like zero garrison now. I think someone just slipped in. Let's see if I can uh, take out some of these catapults. So I'm just worried that they'll take out my like my siege tower there. So we have two taken out. There's two left. Well, the ballista is okay. See if I can get that last ballista done. Are they going to go for it? Okay, so everything is destroyed. We're going to lead an assault. Should be super easy. So I just go to ready. Oh, what did I hit? Okay, there we go. Hit the first person view. So where is it? Straight just back there. We've got our trebuchet helping us out, so we should be doing pretty good. Looks like they're going to go for the ladders. Let's see if I can get this guy up here. Yeah, we got him. I think the ladders are just on the ground usually. And you can go and put them up yourself, I think. Yeah, there's one down there, it looks like. That guy's already dead. Yeah, don't, ah, there we go. I mean, if no one's going to shoot me, then I could do this. They just don't have the manpower to work on this. Who's hitting me? These guys are dying real fast. Let's go over here and take with some of these guys. Just had just missed them. Go up here and follow my guys. Ah, these sieges are, are a lot of fun. Yeah, it looks like most of these guys are probably done for. Guy there? Yeah, there was. And they're, they're coming from that direction, so we've done pretty well here. What are these guys doing? It's like everyone's paused. That's weird. I thought the game was frozen for a second. But it looks like everyone's basically dead. That's maybe that's why. So we had four people die. That's great.
Yeah, so we'll take all the prisoners that we can. Okay, this is awesome. So we're going to show mercy, of course. And I don't, like, the walls aren't damaged or anything, so that's great. We'll just manage the town here, and... Wow, so they're still working on level 2 fortifications. They've got no granary or aqueducts. My loyalty is already doing well. I can leave my wife here for a bit just to uh, increase that a little bit. Because they won't do construction until you're over 20, I think. But it'll sort of correct itself anyways. So the training fields is good. Fairgrounds. The marketplace is a bonus to taxes. I guess I could probably just uh, leave this the way it is for now. They should have done workshops. What are they doing next? Garrison barracks. Uh, they're doing workshops. And they're doing fairgrounds and they're doing workshops. I'll just... Uh, redo this we'll finish off that and then uh, I think I'll do the workshop oh we definitely need a siege workshop and I'll just place my wife as the governor so we get plus four and she'll get some experience and I'll just recruit all these troops and we we'll just garrison them so we've got the keep, the garrison. I guess the militia archers, I don't need those. So they have 54 in the garrison, that should be more than enough, I think. Go back to the town, manage the town. So that should be good for now, and that will recover soon. And food-wise, yeah, I can go and sell some food. I don't think it really matters. Like, that's going to correct itself really fast. Look at the grain I have. Wow. So, we'll sell them a ton of grain. I'm just going to uh, level up my characters and I'll just build up my army again. Wow, a lot of them got some levels here. Okay, the next perk for her will be... Tariff income or tax income. And the number of mounts is greater than the number of foot troops in your party. Or if that includes horses or just mounted infantry. Let's just go for the the, the second one. Okay, he's got... Uh, we'll put speed to the ranged siege engines. So he leveled up really fast. Because I think my level is level 30, but it's maxed out. So I gave him a focus point there. So that's already working out to our favor. And then with the bow, we'll get more damage. Yeah, okay, that sounds good. I'm just going to jump ahead for a bit. Wow, so they're besieging the town. I'll see if I can... Uh, so my wife is governed, but we can definitely take on 520. I guess my... Oh, my caravan. I never made, a, made one of those. So it's not my caravan, but it's part of my faction. So just send the troops there. I'll get a free troop. Oh, I didn't. I guess I didn't uh, upgrade these guys. I guess I'll go for some cavalry. And I'll just try to sneak in here and we'll defend that siege. So we're going to lose 23 troops. So 12 infantry, 5 range, 6 cavalry. That's a pretty huge loss, but what do we have here? So they have everything kind of set up already. 
Yeah, they're just waiting to attack us. Okay, as soon as they made the catapult, we took it out. And then, of course, they lose men when we do that. So now they're attacking, and we'll defend this. So our walls and everything are fine. Okay, this basically looks all right. So I'll just click on ready, and get off my horse. So I can go up destruction. Yeah, I mean, there's just no way they're going to succeed at this. Okay, what do they have? Like, they've got no siege. They just, they just have that uh, Badrin Ram. Yeah, they're running already. Okay, I'll just uh, fish it off here. So what I we lost hardly anything, In, even the militia. Thirteen upgrades. We're gonna have to figure out like how can I have uh, start asking people to be my vassal now. Like hopefully Batania. So just take whatever we can take there. Wow, I'm sure someone can use that. Yeah, if I rest when I restart the game, I'm gonna probably do a companion playthrough. So I could go for those guys, but I'm just going to let them go. Unless they're going to wait around. So the castle here is doing fine. They've kind of capped it on their loyalty. But they're working on uh, one day to get the workshop done. So we'll get some reinforced walls. That'll be great. And then they're going to do uh, whatever this thing is. Uh, Castellan's office. Plus 50% zoom with bows. Visual range on campaign map. Wow. I mean, this looks really great. Just taking less damage. And it protects my formation as well. I've never called a party to an army. Don't know how, don't know how that works. But I'll get plus 10 party size. More morale. I'll go for that one. Okay, well, I, they're not going to do much. So I'm just going to head back. And I guess I can just get more recruits. I mean, I could go for them. It's mostly infantry. And then that would... I wouldn't mind just making peace with them now, actually. Because, man, we're, we're at war with a lot of people now. So I don't know if I can... If that's a good idea. Let me just try to get a little bit more troops. Because if they're headed back, then... 
they have free. Yeah, they're they're not that great. Let's just go ahead and take. The, wow, my friend twenty-seven. If you please stop there, I would ask you for your name. Okay, let's see how this goes. Okay, they're really far away, so if we get the high ground here, I think there's a river in front of us. Yeah, and there's a bridge. Infantry, move! Cavalry, move! Let's get the cavalry out of the way. They're a little far away there. I guess they might be trying to just come around. Infantry forward! Okay, they're, I'm not sure what they're doing, but I, I can defend that pass there. Infantry forward! Going super slow. Uh, how do I... Live formation! There, let's speed him up. Footman! Form a wall! Infantry! Forward! So they're fine, uh, just right there. Horsemen! Move! Get them back there, and then we'll get the Four archers move. up. Okay, here we go. Put me forward! Throw forward! Just a matter of uh, w waiting it out. In case any of my cavalry are archers, I'll get them a little bit closer. Like I think they they did outnumber me, but looks like it's uh, pretty it's evened out. Have 142 infantry. So I think that's a lot more than what I have. Yeah, so I gotta be careful here. I mean, it looks like the they're just trying to run away. I haven't tried my two-handed sword. Okay, good. got to practice that. Oh, nice. But my cavalry should uh, deal with theirs. I'm gonna have my infantry just charge in. Wow, I got one. 
Oh, another one. Wow, I love this. This is dangerous. Wow, it's a lot of fun though. Get my uh, archers to engage. I'm going to lose a fair bit, it seems like. There's just so much infantry that they have. This is not looking good. have the archers uh, charge in. I think we're basically done. Yeah, it's just this guy. In there. Come on, get this guy. Okay, we did it. Let's see what the damage is. I think it's gonna be bad. Oh, it's only 26. I had a lot of uh, poorly trained troops. But only four volunteers and seven wood runners. You gotta take some losses sometimes. But like a lot of my troops are just new guys. Okay, so I've got. Take sixty four. Wow. Okay, so this should be fine. Just uh, max that out. Okay, so where am I? I'm just gonna head back. Get some more recruits. I better get back to Sionin so that they don't take my wife or something. But uh, we can stop here and just see what they do. Yeah, I think they're going to go to Sionin. I could slip behind them. It's super dangerous to try to s squeeze past them. So I'll just get some more troops here and then I'll, I'll follow them to Sionin. But there's no way they could uh, attack us with that kind of party. Okay, so yeah, they're going to... What do we have here? We have uh, basically 200 defending. I'm not going to be able to get anything from those villages. I'm just going to try to sneak in. 
So 24 troops, so 9 infantry, 12 range, 3 cavalry. So it's 600 versus 325. So I've got all of my catapults done. As soon as they build something, I'm going to destroy it. They have uh, two siege towers. Uh, I got ransom. I'll accept that. So they still have one ballista. That's all they're going to have. I'm going to have four catapults. I'm not able to... Sometimes I'll recruit prisoners and things, like, just uh, keep an eye on that. Nothing I can do here, though. Wow, this is crazy. It's so different. I have so much more room to, like, put troops and things. Uh, that's probably too far back to put something, but... Got troops up there. Wow, this is this is really interesting. So this is where they're they're going to come through. They do have uh, two siege towers. So I have to keep an eye on that while I'm fighting. Uh, maybe I'll squeeze something back here. Or uh, like any, any troops up there would be good too. So I'm going to be somewhere around here, which I think is an okay spot. I can come back, climb up there. I think the setup is pretty good. I mean, I don't think their siege towers are going to last. So maybe I can stick up here. And these guys are packed in. Okay, everything's coming this direction. Done. It's good. Yeah, I mean, I didn't think they could do it anyways. Oh, so we still lost. My last one, 31 get to be ranked up. Okay, we'll take all those guys. Wow. I mean, I've, I've lost a ton of troops, though. Just over the last few battles, it, the little bit you lose adds up so quickly. Step Warbo, I think that's new. Okay, so we'll return to Sionin. Man, they got a lot of troops left. I think I'll just wait it out here, see if we got any levels. Oh, a couple people. I mean, she's always going to be my archer, so I'll probably max this out. I should consider giving her a crossbow, just so it, just in case. I do have some crossbow troops, but we'll just max out her her skill there. And who else was it? Marywin, the Wanderer. She's my scout, so I've got to max that out. I think that's it. Yeah. Hey, that was awesome. Let's go to the Tyvern District. 18,600 for prisoners. Let's see what else I can get. Go to the keep, the dungeon. It has a whole bunch more, too. And then go to the Tyvern District. 21,000 more for prisoners. Wow. 
So I actually can get another companion, I think. Yeah. So it'll be interesting to see what this guy turns out like. And he should he's definitely gonna be Batanian. He's got so many negative traits, unfortunately. So let's just see where these guys go. I wouldn't mind going out there and they're gonna attack again. That's real dumb. Yeah, we've got four catapults, so as soon as they build anything, we're going to take it out. They've got their two siege towers in a Biden ram. So I think they'll just attack at any moment. But they'll keep losing troops every time we destroy those. And of course, like, we'll lose a little bit too. But I mean, they may as well just uh, give up already. I'm going to request a parlay. And see if they just want to do... Uh, uh, make peace. They want 30,000. They don't really want that much. But... Uh, I was just curious to see what they wanted. Because right now they're just a, they're building ballistas and I'm just destroying them. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, this guy just showed up. So that would be a fun battle. But I think my number's actually growing now. And theirs was shrinking. I've got four days of food left. So, 1400 versus 370. That's pretty crazy. So, I like, like every person's going to have to kill four. And they'll just have one ballista, and I've got four catapults. I mean, my catapults each can probably kill 100. I mean, like, uh, total. So, maybe I should have made peace. Uh, we'll just jump in. I think this is fine. I, yeah, I don't like this position, though. Yeah, maybe I will go upstairs. Yeah, actually, I've got to get to the main gate. Kind of wasted some time here, but that's okay. So the main gate is quite a ways away. So did we take one down? Looks like we did. Yeah, I don't think they're going to run this time. Yeah, where's all their troops, though? Oh, there is? Everyone, attack! 
they're running, right? Yeah, I was just, I was just thinking they're running to like a, a hole in the wall or something. Nice. Well, I don't think we're going to chase them down or anything, but that was pretty good. See how many we killed there. Yeah, they didn't send in the whole... I think I have it set up with the battles are at max 1,000 or something. I put it to the maximum. But we only killed 145. It wasn't that fun. I was hoping for more of a challenge there. Okay, that looks good. And then just get a whole bunch of loot, probably. Can I not take all that? Well, I'm inside, so I should be able to just sell that. Okay, so there's still a whole bunch of them out there. Not many of them really died. I'm just going to sell the food and things. Okay, man, 16,000. I haven't even sold all this stuff. It just, that's just some of it. But thankfully, I've got a ton of food on me. So, uh, Sionin's going to need it. So, just sell them all that. And yeah, I've got all this armor and stuff. I'll just sell some of it, but i got so much, uh, too much stuff on me. So hang on to that. I think someone will be able to use that. And hang on to those as well. It's a lot of junk. There's so much, so much stuff. 32,000 already. Okay, I don't know what exactly I'm carrying. But Sionin will love all this food. It must be a... Uh, it's so a lot of meat and things, a lot of butter. Oh, it's a ton of fish. So they'll love that, sell that to them. And then I'll just buy whatever they have to make up for the difference. Yeah, so I'll just take like all their Sumter horses here, 27. Take all their nice horses. They'll give me some more capacity. And they do have a nice helmet for like 64,000. Just a little bit better than mine. Well, anyways, I think that's pretty good. We'll get 52,000. And then I'll bring my wife back in. Now that we're building things, I'll bring my wife back into the party. Okay, I don't know who's my quartermaster. I think it's me right now, so... Yeah, I just have to talk to my wife. She's in the keep. So our max party is going to be 201. That's pretty awesome. Just got to recruit a whole bunch of uh, troops now. Just going to think I'll end the episode here. I just got to wait around and then see what these guys do if they try to do a proper siege. Wow, I can recruit all these guys too. Yeah, so they're not going to do well trying to hang around here. We've got plenty of food and everything. But anyways, guys, hit that like button. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you on the next episode.